Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome back to to uh, back back to the channel. Um, we're on a bit of a wander today. We've parked up at Great Coxwell Barn, which is behind me. Maybe you can see it. Uh, where is it? It's sort of in that direction behind the tree. Um, and we're going back to there, so we'll take some photos of that later on. But we're making our way through the fields up to Babby Clump. Um, and from what I've seen, um, the bluebells are well and truly out. So uh, make our way up there and uh, see if we can get a few images for ourselves. I've got the macro lens, so uh, hopefully we can get some really nice images. And I got some info a bit later on about what's happening with the channel. So uh, stay tuned. So we've walked through from Great Coxwell Barn and we've come through to um, Babri Clump. It's extremely busy, uh, but hopefully we'll be able to find something. If not, we're going to go for a little walk and come back because it brings us back to here anyway. And then we'll uh, see if we can get a spit later on. But, uh, but yeah, blue bowels at Babri Clump at last. I'll speak to you in a minute. Okay, so we've come out of the main clump at the moment. Gone for a little walk around the woods area. It's really quite busy up there. But when I get back up there, I'm going to be looking to do a nice panoramic, take some nice close-up intimate shots with a macro lens and just see what I can get. Um, maybe something for a canvas. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm on a bit of a wander around. I'll speak to you in a minute. Really quite a nice view from up here, um, but it is very busy today. Okay, find a nice little composition here. It's got to be quick, it's really busy. Um, but it's like a path that leads down down through the trees. So I've got that as my leading line, down through into the trees. 
and the uh, sun's coming through the trees quite nicely. So I'm bracketing the shot because it is quite bright and outside and quite dark inside. Uh, I'll warm it up a little bit in post. Um, two shots either side, two and four stops either side I should say. If it's any good I'll stick it up. Okay, so I've got another competition, a comp competition composition here. There's another path that leads down into the woods. Um, pretty much the same as one as I had last time, but I sort of balanced out with one tree on the right and the three trees on the left. I've got the sun rays coming through. I've bracketed the shot, obviously ISO 100. It's gonna be a 15th of a second. Let me know what you think in the comments and uh, we're gonna walk on round and see if we can't find something I can take a macro shot of. I love this place. Okay, so I've got the macro lens on. Um, I've set up a nice little composition here where um, I'll stick it around a little bit. Where I'm focusing on one of these ones that are close to the edge, and obviously you've got the sea of blue behind. You can't really see that because it's a macro lens, um, but you've got a few blurred blue bells behind it. Um, I did just catch a tiniest little spider, I think, um, sat on one of the petals. So if that comes up, if that comes out okay, I'll put up that up. Um, but all in all, quite a nice, quite a nice afternoon out. A Badbury clump. Uh, I'm going to walk on down to Great Coxwell Barn. There's a couple of shots I want of that. Uh, a couple of shots I want inside, looking up at the at the structure from inside. Um, it's a huge barn. So we're going to make our way down there. I'm going to sign up from down there. So I'll see you there. Okay, so that was Bluebell Woods, Babbury Woods. Um, quite a sight at this time of year, and very busy at this time of year. Although other times of the year it's pretty quiet. Um, that's all there is there. A few birds of prey in the sky, but not brought any long lenses today. Um, concentrating on the blue bowels and things up close. I've got my landscape lens as always. Uh, so we're going to work our way back down to Great Coxwell Barn uh, as part of the National Trust. Take some shots of that, it's a magnificent structure, um, very old, very original and uh, yeah looking forward to sit, taking some good shots of that, we will see you when we get down there. Okay so I'm just taking some long exposures to finish up the day, um, we've obviously been to Great Coxville Barn, it's the first visit here and we've been up to Blue Bow Woods, uh, Babbury Woods to see the Blue Bows, um, so uh, it's all in all a successful trip. Um, I haven't forgotten that I let you. I did say that I'd let you know where the channel was going, uh, so we can get packed up here. We're going to shoot home because uh, I'm really quite thirsty, and uh, I'll let you know what's going on. So uh, keeping you hanging on till the end. It's nothing bad, but it's uh, it's quite a big change. Um, so I'll stick up these long exposures, 30 seconds, f13, ISO 100. There's a couple of different ones, a couple from inside the barn, and uh, I'll speak to you again in a minute.
Hi guys, thanks for sticking with the sticking with this week's episode right to the end. Um, although I expect a few of you have skipped through, which I don't really blame you. Um, yeah, I just uh, put up a, um, a little bit of a picture there of all my Pentax lenses and my Pentax camera all boxed up. Me and Pentax are uh, a parting company and I'm changing my complete system. I feel Pentax is a, my Pentax K1 is a fantastic camera and I'm not gonna have a bad word said against it. Um, it's not a wildlife camera, but for, as far as landscapes go, I don't think there's a better camera out there. Cue the, cue the comments. The lenses on the other hand, are very limited in my view. I want to go further with the macro, uh, with the Macro Monday series. I want to look deeper, I want to look closer. Um, so, and this, this limited me to do that. So I can't take that further unless I change system. Um, what am I changing to? <sighs> That'd be telling. Uh, you'll have to come back um, either Monday or Thursday, depending on when I get my macro lens. If I get it before Monday, I'll put one out Monday, but it's not 100% at the moment. Um, but I will be putting a vlog out next Thursday. I'm revealing what it is that I've switched to. A couple of you will already know, so if you want to try and keep it to yourselves just for now. Pentax have done me done me proud, they really have. Um, and they are, they're a great camera. If somebody's looking for a, a great camera that takes great shots of landscapes, that isn't too quick, isn't too fast, but has great resolution, then uh, the Pentax K1 is definitely uh, a camera I would recommend. If you're looking for birds in flight or anything fast moving, then no, I'm sorry I can't recommend it for that. But uh, yeah, hopefully I should get a good deal on, on my Pentax stuff. Um, I've got a list of lenses and a certain camera which I want to swap it for, hopefully, if I can get enough for mine. Keeping that under wraps until next week, so just a little bit longer to wait. Uh, but yeah, hopefully the channel can grow a little bit, especially on the macro side. I'm, I'm really... Um, Really enjoying the macro side of it so uh, hopefully I can take that further and take things closer and and yeah hopefully uh, bring you guys a lot more content from the macro Monday series so I've had a few comments from a few of you saying that you're really enjoying it and it means a heck of a lot to me it really does so I'm really glad you're enjoying it but I want to make it better and um, to do make to make it better I gotta change systems. So uh, so yeah, that's the big news. The channel's not going anywhere. It's growing really nicely. Um, I'd like to welcome all the latest and new subscribers. A big thanks to all the original subscribers that have stuck and hung in there with me right from the start. And a few that have joined along the way. Thank you so much. I wouldn't be doing this if it wasn't for you. So, uh, so thank you very much for following the channel. Um, hopefully we can make the channel bigger and better and uh, Give it a good future. So, uh, bored you for long enough. That's the news. Pentax is out. New camera system is coming in. And next week I'll reveal what it is I've swapped to. Thanks so much for watching. If you've liked it, give it a thumbs up. Give it a share. If you haven't yet, then please consider subscribing. I really want to build this channel up a bit. So, uh, so yeah. I'll see you next week. Bye for now. Never said for anything, less than everything